Remains. I was captured. Only I escaped. What happened to them? Indoctrinated. The Reapers sent them against me. Year after year, battle after battle, I was hunted by my own people. Every encounter, a reminder of my failure as a soldier. Sorry. I had no idea. Until the Battle of the Cronian Nebula. I had only my knife left. I cornered my men and slit their throats one by one. I watched them bleed to death to be certain. That... must have been... It was the day I understood. War is atrocity committed in the name of survival. It is a lesson I wish I had never learned. The crew seem shocked by the experiments at Sanctuary. They shouldn't be. Why is that? Our war lasted for centuries. It provided more time for worse atrocities to be committed. There was a species, the Densorian. They became convinced the Reapers could be placated by sacrificing their own young. The entire planet joined in this ritual. I would spare you the details, but it did not work. They simply made the Reaper's job easier. It was as your elusive man is now. His ambitions are nothing short of madness. Sharpen your knife, Commander. His is a voice that must be silenced, and a throat that must be slit. Subjugating the Reapers will not bring victory. Only their extinction will. Commander. Gabby, what do you think about our new yeoman, Miss Trainer? She's not a yeoman, she's a communication specialist. And you're barking up the wrong tree, Kenneth. You're not her type. Oh, well... Perhaps you should go and talk to her then. Maybe I should. Nobody's barking up my tree. If it works out, be sure to take video. Nothing to report. Commander. Commander. Sir. Sir. I can't believe the elusive man really found a way to control the Reapers. I mean, he's still fucking crazy, but damn. Imagine if he was on our side. But I guess that's exactly what the Reapers want. Get us all fighting each other. Divide and conquer. Exactly. Just one more reason to hate them. I can't wait to take the fight to the elusive man. I wonder what he's thinking right now. You just know he's got a plan. I saw the Crucible data Hackett sent. I don't know what the hell it does, but damn if it isn't impressive. Do you hear that hum? Is that just me? Shepard, the intel you sent looks good. The fleets are ready to go. But? Once we're committed against Cerberus, it won't be long before the Reapers take notice. And the Crucible? Ready. Except for the Catalyst. But there's no way to hide the ships we'll be sending at Cerberus. 
Once we attack, the Crucible won't stay safe for long. For all intents and purposes, an assault on Cerberus will be the first stage of our attack on Earth. What happens if Cerberus doesn't have the intel we need? Or they stop us from getting it? Then we lead the fleets to Earth and we take our chances. But your intel points to Cerberus and the elusive man holding the information we're looking for. And... we have the element of surprise. Cerberus won't know what hit him. I want to make sure we're ready before we commit. Understood. The fleets are ready when you are. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on VidCom. Commander, something on your mind? What are your thoughts on Cerberus? I think it's obvious by now the elusive man is insane. Not that he wasn't always a special form of crazy, but this is getting downright dangerous. And I don't care what he thinks he's proven, there's only one way we defeat the Reapers. No more Reapers. But what if the Reapers really can be controlled? That's like trying to tame a shark. Somebody's gonna end up dead. In this case, it would be the whole galaxy. He's the worst possible person to give that kind of power to. Kill him. That's an order. What's our state of readiness, Admiral? Given the situation everywhere else as close as we can be, you've done well, Shepard. What's the Reaper situation? As you know, the Asari homeward fell. The Turians are under heavy siege and probably won't hold out. Same goes for the Krogan. The Salarians are putting up a spirited defense. Not sure how long that can last. The Shrike Abyssal, Celia Nebula, Ethan Cluster, Hades Gamma, all in trouble. We're losing the galaxy fast, Shepard. What about the extra help we picked up along the way? It's a testament to your efforts that even with everyone's back to the wall, they're still honoring their commitments. Bringing in both the Quarians and the Geth has helped us immeasurably. The Quarian fleet is providing evac and fire support, while the Geth attack Reaper supply lines. How about the Asari and Salarians? Since the coup attempt, the Asari have stepped up to the plate. They're committing fleets and sending us... And believe it or not, they promised us the Destiny Ascension. They haven't forgotten you saved it three years ago. Nothing more, sir. Hack it out. Commander Shepard. Commander. Commander, are you ready to send the fleets against the Cerberus stronghold? The Reapers and Cerberus started this. Now we're gonna end it. I'll get the fleets mobilized.
Shepard, we've arrived. The crew is waiting. The strike team is in. We've got our foothold. Fifth Fleet, all forward. I don't want a single server ship in my sky when we're through. Shepard, I should accompany you on this mission. Why? This is the central point of operations for Cerberus. They will have enhanced security measures. With my knowledge of Cerberus algorithms and this body's updated protocols, I offer the best chance to help you succeed. Grab your gear. Joker, what's our status? We've got a foothold, but it's not much, Commander. A lot of fighters guarding the launch base. Can you get us in? Hey, I got us to Ilos. I can do this. It might be a bumpy ride, though. Do what you can. Shepard, I am ready. Wait, wh what? Are you crazy? You can't go to Cerberus headquarters. They could have a virus or a kill switch or... I will be fine, Jeff. Head to the shuttle, Edie. Fifth Fleet's cut through their line. They're regrouping. Now's as good a time as any. I know it hurts, not being able to go with her. Yeah, it sucks. Thanks for bringing that up. Hey, Shepard. Keep her safe. Same to you. Shepard, they're launching spiders! 